Wrestling and volleyball, just two of the sports teams winning at Jensen Beach High. 13th district title and three weeks ago they won a, a state dual championship for the first time. The 1A, they were 1A mm -hmm. dual state champions and Mike has also been very successful with volleyball, um, four state titles, I think two state runner-up finishes. It's been a long time in the making, more than 20 years in fact. RJ and I were at West Virginia University together. We both wrestled. Uh, RJ was a 177 pounder. I was a heavyweight. Uh, we both graduated at the same time. And we just happened to be talking to our head coach about what we we're going to do with the rest of our life. That was back in the 80s. During that conversation, RJ Costello and Mike Sautel learned about possible assistant coach positions for wrestling at Martin County High. We looked at each other again and we're like, where's that? Next thing they know, they're in Stewart, interviewing for jobs. Their partnership and friendship was meant to be from day one. Literally, they were born in the same hospital, same year, same month. And Mike was born on April 28th in the evening, and I was born on April 29th in the morning. So we were probably in cribs right next to each other, beating up each other yeah. and everything. Coach Tom McMath joins the picture, let's just say several years later. He grew up about 45 minutes away from Costello and Sautel. So they were talking about 1993 and all that. I was 13 years like that at, at that age, so <laughs> I'm a little, little younger than these guys. Besides location, they all have one thing in common, West Virginia wrestling. That connection brought all three down here. I didn't know RJ, I've never met him, and I never met him either. And I trusted him, you know, through the connections of West Virginia, and this guy's picking me up at the airport and I'm staying with him and driving his car. And they were able to coach a Jensen Beach High and do it their way, bringing a little bit of the Mountaineers to Martin County. You find that work ethic and you can relate to people like that. And I think that's what brought us all together. Uh, and that's why we're successful. Be the best version of yourself every day to be, you know, 1% better. That kind of coaching, they hope, continues to bring more state titles. The Lord works in mysterious ways. <laughs> there was a reason for every single one of us to be here. Speaking of, the Jensen Beach wrestling team just won their first traditional state championship.